Hello everyone, my name is Sheila Mann and I'm the founder of Valley Interiors. In today's episodes, we go inside the home of Indonesian model and personality Inda Kalalo. Her home is a unique property decorated with artifacts, sculptures and textiles from travels through Indonesia and beyond. Before we begin, I want to thank you for watching our videos, commenting and supporting us. Our mission in this channel is to highlight the beautiful designs, unique properties and venues and take a peek into places that inspire us. If you're new to our channel, please press the subscribe button and help us achieve our goal of reaching 50,000 subscribers. This season is possible thanks to our sponsor, Paloma Hardware. Now, let's watch today's episode of Picking Paradise with Inda Kalalo. Om Swastiastu, welcome to Fila Nyupi. I'm Inda Kalalo and come take a peek on my paradise. This house is really, truly a family home. We have total 11 rooms, consist of seven bedrooms. So this house is super perfect for big families and then for families that comes from all over the world to come and visit us. The size of this house is uh, 24 ara. The house is surrounded by a river. It's like we are on in an island. That's why we call this place Villa Nyepi. My husband, Justin, and I, we really love Indonesian beautiful art from all over Indonesia. So, for example, like this painting, we have it from an Indonesian artist from Jogja. And then this uh, sofa are made from Indonesian artists as well. Now, let me show you where I cook. Come to the kitchen. So here is the open kitchen. This is also one of my favorite spots. This is where I cook for my family and friends and that whenever I throw a big party, everybody can come here and fit the kitchen and help me. Let me take you to the dining table. Here we are in the dining table where there we can find a four meter long table with 10 seats. We can sit for hours and hours in this dining table long after we dine. And here you can see we have this massive tree copper lamp. This is made in Java. And also we can see the decoration for, for the artwork just behind the stairs. It's from Timor. Let's go to one of the rooms that is inspired by one of our trips to India. Welcome to the Indian room. Yes, this is inspired by our trip to India. As you can see, many artifacts here, we bought it straight from India. But there are also some, like this uh, bed over here. This is an Indonesian made, of course, from Java. But I think the color uh, resonates with an Indian look. And also, this is a place where I love to do my meditation and yoga. Villa Nyepi is consist by two joglos. One is inspired by Indonesian ethnicities. We call it the Indonesian bedrooms. There's three bedrooms in there. I can't wait to show you. Now we are in the living room of our second joglo. The furnitures here are very special for us too. This painting, we bought it in Amanjiwo in Yogyakarta, made by the local artist there. It's a really beautiful painting of the head of a Buddha. And this table is very special for me because one day, one of the trees in our house fell down and then we cut it. And then we're like, we would like to keep a piece of this wood and we turn it into a table. From our Javanese lounge, Let's go inside to one of the best rooms in this area. It's called the Papua Room. Yeah. 
hello from Papua. Although this place is still on my bucket list, but I adore the furniture from Papua. As you can see, next to the TV, both huge statues are from Papua. And this bed, mm, <laughs> look, all carved wood made from Papua. So this is the Javanese bathrooms where we have a stone bath. Our children and I and my husband, all five of us can fit in this big beautiful bath stone. Let's go to the Javanese room. Ta-da! Welcome to the Javanese room. Here in this room we can see we collected Wayangs. Wayang is a famous uh, Javanese traditional puppets. <laughs> and also we can see it here, here, all the decoration, all are from Java. And also, don't forget, if you see here, the tiles are also made in Java. Welcome to my favorite area, the pool, of course where we have so many endless day and night, just swimming, having a good time with friends and family. And there, over there, is we have one big table of teak wood table. This is the fun area for everyone to enjoy. We're gonna take you to the main room, which is the African room. Come on. This is the master bedroom. We call it the African room. Yes, Africa is one of my favorite places to visit with my whole family. These African masks have been collected by my husband over the years and he brought it one by one when he was living in South Africa in Johannesburg, way before he married me. <laughs> but then we combine it with Indonesian tribe that I think looks like African tribes too. And now let's go to my favorite room, the closet. <laughs> Since my modeling days, fashion has always been my passion. And of course, I also have a boutique, Just We Flirt, which you can see in my collection. And this is where I store all my precious dresses and where I do my makeup every day. Really big space for a beautiful woman to keep their beauty. <laughs> From the closet, this is the area where we like to chat with my children and my husband and hang out with the doggy. So this room connected with the outdoor area again, where I love to daydream. And when the children are still small, they love to do rocking in this chair. <laughs> so this is the sunset lounge, where we can all hang out and chill out, talk with friends, have a glass of wine or two. And also, this place is awesome when it's full moon and there's lots of stars in the sky or when it's nyepi it's the best where we can all hang out here and just gaze to the stars so this is the jacuzzi room it's outdoor and it's amazing Bali Interiors for taking a peek in my paradise. I'll see you next time, but please don't forget to subscribe. Mwah! Love from the island of Bali.